It's the BSV bulldozer. <laughs> okay, sorry for the immature opening. Um, this video is going to be about the wonderful, amazing BlackRock ETF. Thank God for the BlackRock ETF. I think that'll be the title. So, it's sarcasm, people. Australians are incredibly sarcastic, and that is bitter sarcasm. So I'm going to paint a picture to you of what I think may be a possible scenario. BlackRock are not our friends. BlackRock are not our friends. And I think what's happening is that the Bitcoin ETF has sent prices up and people are getting this idea that we're entering a bull market. Now, that may be the case. You know, the, the tether money printers are in full swing. However, what if they pull a Swifty on us? <laughs> so I have thought of this, and if I've thought of it, then they've thought of it. So let me paint this picture to you. Everybody thinks that now we're entering this bull market, and uh, people are highly bullish on Bitcoin and maybe any variant of Bitcoin, but in particular BTC, Blockstream coin. And so they start dumping their money, of course, into the thing and um, things go, get, start getting really crazy and they, they start pumping BTC even more with fresh amounts of tether. And um, meanwhile, in the background, BlackRock are orchestrating a coup where they have their whatever, their bots, their their um, traders hovering over the short sell button <laughs> and uh, what they do is they start piling up all of these short sell positions they would have to do it very quickly but um, they do this before they announce to the public that oh we've decided that bitcoin is not a thing to invest in um, this ETF is not a good idea, it's not going to work, BTC has these problems, da 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 da, -da and we're going to withdraw our application for an ETF. And what happens to the BTC price? It crashes dramatically down like, what? Well, it's around 55k Australian, it, it more than halves, easy. I could see this easily happening, right? I've learnt something really, really uh, interesting and probably a lot of people know this, but do they actually know it? Do they see it when it happens? And it's the, the chorus. When you hear the chorus in crypto, get ready for the opposite to happen. So I've seen it before the start of a bull market when BTC went down to 5k Australian, which was the bottom, around three and a half, three to three and a half, US and people were saying it's going to go down to $1,000 and the general consensus is how low can it go it can keep going right and there was no barely anybody that was saying that it was the start of a bull market or the start of it coming out of the bear market and I at that point I said this is the end of the bear market when you've got the chorus and I've seen it so many times this chorus when it's the bull market and everything's all happy and everybody's just throwing thousands and thousands of dollars at the cryptos it's time to get out i spoke to this guy on um, telegram who was really bullish and overly optimistic about the cryptos and he was saying things like um, this is going to keep going for a while and the nail in the coffin for him was he said to me i can't lose and to me I even at that point said, okay, this has to be probably an indication that we are um, at the top of the bull market. And he had 140k invested in cryptos and it tanked massively now, depending on the crypto. And if he stayed in crypto if that, with that 140k, that could be worth as low as 20k now.
depending on the cryptos that he bought. I'm not. I'm pretty sure that he it was he wasn't all in Bitcoin or BTC. Sorry, I shouldn't call BTC Bitcoin. It should be Blockstream coin. So, warning, people. <laughs> this may be a false dawn. This may not be the start of the bull market. And BlackRock are not our friends. They may be there, ready to punk us, and pull a major swifty and really just send BTC into the doldrums. So that's it. I've got several videos that I've thought about producing, but uh, I'm a bit reluctant to do it. You could help me with some enthusiasm to produce these videos by sending me a little bit of BSV. I've got my BSV address there posted. Chuck me some BSV and you might see the inspiration to deliver these videos increase a little bit. Hope you've enjoyed. Take care. Bye for now.